Hello Light Travelers, today we're taking a look at the Cavalier, right, which is a cotton t-shirt by a company called Threadsmiths. Although you cannot tell from looking at it, this is no ordinary cotton t-shirt. It is coated with a patented nanotechnology which makes it hydrophobic. This means that no matter what you throw at it or pour onto it, it will be repelled from the fabric. It's quite similar to the nanotex coating that Outlier uses on their shirts and pants. I found that with the Threadsmiths t-shirt, that if you leave the water on the t-shirt for a few minutes, it begins to slowly seep into the fabric. This means if you do wear the shirt in light rain or heavy rain, that after a while the water will penetrate into the shirt's fabric. The cotton of the shirt actually looks and feels like any other cotton t-shirt. Just from touching and feeling and looking at it, you wouldn't know that it has any kind of special coating. This makes me wonder if they could perhaps apply this same nanotechnology to a merino wool t-shirt. The t-shirt does breathe well in hot weather, just like any other cotton t-shirt. However, it doesn't keep you warm when it's cold outside in the same way that merino wool does. It does repel water, and for this reason it could be a good t-shirt to work out in. So it doesn't stick to the inside and it just rolls off in much the same way as a merino wool. I've been able to wear the shirt for a few days in a row, and I've noticed that it doesn't smell quite as bad as a regular cotton t-shirt. I believe this is due to the nano coating, which helps repel the odours from sticking to the inside of the shirt. However, I have noticed that it's not quite as antimicrobial as a merino wool t-shirt. In conclusion, without firm regulation and natural antimicrobial features, I would be hard pressed to choose this shirt over a merino wool t-shirt, especially given the price of 55 US dollars or 75 Australian dollars. It really depends on whether you need high water repellency or thermal regulation more. I really do hope that Threadsmiths find a way to apply this nanotechnology to merino wool and create the ultimate travel t-shirt. Sensei, thanks very much for watching. Thank you to David Mason for sending me out the shirt. And be sure to tune in next week for the next video.